Today I am showing you guys every single tip and trick to complete the new Stumble Up 2 map. So the new Stumble Up 2 map just came out and I've been playing it for about 40 minutes and I found all the best tips and tricks that I can give to you guys in this video so that's what I'm going to be doing today. So let's hop into the first trick that I have for you that can help you get a faster time. Okay, so for the first tip that I have for you on this very hard jump after the second checkpoint in Stumble Up 2, you guys might think you want to jump from the very top right here. But if you jump where T Bones jumps from at the lower end, it's actually a lot e it's actually a lot easier to make the jump. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say, but my mic cut out and then my computer turned off. So basically what you want to do is jump at the very end just like that, and then it's super easy to hit that jump if you really time it. Now, I've been playing Stumble Up for about 30 minutes, so I figured out all of the best tips and tricks, and I'm going to put them all in this video for you guys today. Okay, guys, so when you make it to the saw, what you want to do is jump over to the left because the saw is super glitchy. T-Bone, step on the saw and show the one what happened. You get an auto dive, and then you start panicking, and you will end up falling off. So it's better just to completely ignore it. Okay, now I need to make my way onto the rails, and then now we are at the third checkpoint. And then as you can see, if you look around the map, the whole theme of Stumble Up is like dreamy patterns, sleepy patterns, right, T-Bones? Or is there any other words you can use to describe it? Um, luminescence is a good Yeah, word. that is a... Okay, luminescent. Yeah, I like that one a lot. You're very smart. Okay, nice. Yeah, another tip and trick is that, like, if you don't want to climb all the way on top of this bottle cap and then, like, the arrow, you can literally just, like, single jump right here and then just jump to the platform. Ooh, okay, yeah, that's actually a really good one because most players would go to the arrow because that's, like, human intuition to go to arrow, so that's a very good trick by T-Bones. Nice, okay. And then, uh, rather than, like, taking the long scenic route over here, you can, uh, simply just jump right here and then jump around it's pretty easily unless you're a noob okay uh, that's so two yeah. tricks right there from t-bones nice t-bone so that's already a good way to get a better run on stumble up and on these boxes you don't have to go left to right you can actually just skip the entire gap and just jump from this one all the way over to this one it's a very good way to save time and then now you get to the ferris wheel section and the best way to do it is actually just to stand still do not try and do anything else because you will die they made it to where you have to take some time off of your run right at this section because they do not want me and T-Bones getting like a two minute run. So they have to make us wait just a little bit. And then wait till you're even with it. And then you can jump to the next checkpoint. It's super easy. People always try and anticipate the jump and jump earlier than they need to. And they always end up dying here. Okay. And when you make it to this checkpoint right here, what you want to do is you see there's dark blue. And then you see there's light blue. And then you see there's purple. You want to jump on the light blue section. It's the easiest place to hit. So you want to time your jump perfectly and then right on the light blue section. If you jump for the purple, you're going to be aiming too high and you'll end up dying. Now, guys, a very good skip. Me and T-Bones both are going to do it. You can go all the way up to the top of this and just jump to the next checkpoint. So easy instead of going if, all the way around. However, if this isn't stumble up easy, like you're doing regular stumble up two, I would jump right here because normally there wouldn't be any checkpoint there. Oh, you are right. So yeah, if this is not stumble up easy, you would jump to that roof. Yeah, nice point out, T-Bones. All right, let's keep going. Oh my god. Oh, what a save! T-Bones, what a save! That was crazy. Nice. Now, guys, you obviously want to jump to here. Now, this jump. Now, I have a very good tips and tricks for you. You guys did not watch Baby Yoda's video. He explained it the best. So what you need to do is jump right here and then double jump again. And it's how to hit it every single time. T-Bones, you, you can try and use that trick. Let's see if you can do it. Yo, my controller just died, bro. I'll be right back. All right, peace. A second tip for you guys at this section right here, you can actually jump back right here. And then whenever someone tries to jump over to you, you can actually body block them midair if you want to troll some of your opponents in your first place. You can literally camp at this section right here and just kill everyone that's coming towards you. But only do that if you're really toxic. If you're not toxic, I would not recommend doing it. Now, when you make it to this log right here, most players would go out here to make the jump easier, but there's a way to skip it completely by going at this corner right about here. It's a very, very difficult jump to make, but if you want to save a few seconds, that's what you can do if you are confident with your jumps. Okay, when you make it to right here, you guys might have also saw this in Yoda's video, but you cannot dive onto this wall because it's not able to get dove on or stood on, so you just need to jump to this platform right over here. It is a very tight jump. As you can see, I just missed it. So I need to start making my way back up to T-Bones. Okay, so here we go. This is how you want to hit the jump. Just like that, you just need to wait to the very, very end of your jump. And then now you make it onto the wood, like picnic table is what I like to call it. And then you have to jump on the single branch. And there we go. Okay, so now we have made it to the next checkpoint. Remember, this is stumble up easy, guys. So take that into consideration. I just slipped off. Okay, I got the checkpoint though, so we're good, but I'd rather not fall all the way down, so I'm just gonna make my way back over. I mean, I know how to do that part really, really easy. Actually, this is a good time to show you guys. Oh, you actually can 
You actually can jump on it, but you need to land in the crack. But I would just suggest going from there over to here. Okay, here we go. And then I make my way onto the twig just like that. Perfect. So we're going to go on this one right here. There's no really tips and tricks in this area of the map. And there's no shortcuts or anything. So I'm just going to do the normal run. Okay, so now we have made it to the pillars. Now, this is like the Greek Athen go area around here. So this is probably the hardest area of all of Stumble Up. So as you can see, T-Bones missed his jump. So I need to make my first jump. And... I did the same exact thing as him. You always overshoot it. So make sure when you guys are doing that jump, you undershoot it. It's always easier than you think. And then these jumps right here are all single jumps. You do not need to dive at all. If you do dive, you will end up going too far. And then this one you have to dive on. So what I would do is I would not run and then jump dive. I would, I would jump dive from right here when you're still standing on the platform. So you make sure you do not overshoot it. And then this one, I would do the same exact thing. Do not jump and then dive right as you're about to come off. Jump while you're standing on the platform. Okay, and then as you see, we make it to the lion statue. Now, this is the hardest, like, statue slash formation in the entire game. Because the arrow is so, so buggy. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to completely sell and have to restart all over again for my fifth take. Okay, guys, when you get on top of this arrow, you want to turn backwards and then go to the lion's head. That's how you skip that entire section it's probably one of the best tips and tricks of this entire video. But what we did with the lion's mane is actually the easier route. If you guys go on the very tip of that arrow over there and then jump onto the building, you would get where T-Bones is and then he would go to the right onto those barrels over there. So when you go on top of the lion's mane, what you have to do is go all the way around. You, could, you can jump from this one under the roof. I just took the safe way because I do not feel like dying right now. And then you would make it all the way over here where T-Bones is at. Okay, and then when you guys make it to right here, how you get on top of this first pillar is jump from far away. So, T-Bones, if you want to go first, and then I'll go after you. Yeah. <laughs> but just do that. But you need to dive, or you don't need to dive? No, you need to dive. Okay, well, how I would do it is do a lava land, like, one block, where you do it right here, and then immediately turn around. That's how I find it easier, but you can always do it however you like in your preference. Okay, now you make it to the arrow. Guys, I have died on here about five times trying to give you guys a tip on how to do it. T-Bones, can you explain how to get past this arrow easily? So basically, you want to like try to stay towards the middle of the arrow. Um, and like stand up. You're going to have to dive onto it and then like stand up afterwards. Three, two, one, go. And there, there we go. go. You, yeah, you just need to tightrope it all the way across. All right, nice, T-Bones. Let's go. Perfect. All right, now we are finishing okay. the end. Now we are and nearing the end of the map. Okay, T-Bones just found an amazing, amazing skip. So instead of doing this whole entire section, all you need to do from T-Bones is go on this trampoline, and then you can make it all the way over there with a single jump. No! <laughs> I got the checkpoint, so we can immediately try it again. But T-Bones did it first try, so it's really, really possible if you just lock in. Why would you not? I don't know. <laughs> all right, so the... Like this. So what you need to do is, yeah, T-Bones, show me really fast while I'm watching. So right on the edge. Okay, are you going to make it? Oh, you went a little <laughs> bit too far from the edge. All right, here we go. I'm going to go right on the edge. Hold W. Oh, the arrow got my way. Here we go. Right on the edge. And there we go, guys. That's how you skip that entire section. Oh, my God. That's so easy, T-Bones. Nice. All right, let's see if you can You're do welcome. it. Let's see. Come on. Watch out for the arrow. Hold W. Yeah. Oh, you got to go back. All right, it's fine. Go. Can he hit it? Nice. All right. All right, so now we have another arrow, and you just got to go right in the middle and jump. There we go. So the tip that I would have for you with arrows, you always want to avoid jumping while you're on one and just stay straight like T-Bones. Try and go on the arrow, and I would avoid jumping because if you do end up jumping, correct me if I'm wrong, T-Bones, you will get put into dive most of the time. Yes, you're right. All right, bet. Then you, I would not jump on an arrow. All right, now we are nearing the finish, and then we have three more arrows, and as you can see, we have... The mythic uh, lightning bolt skin up there. We are nearing the last three arrows, so here we go. My tip is to not jump and just stay straight. Come on, don't jump and stay straight. 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 I'm jumping, and I jumped, and it, it completely ruined me. So I have to try and finish the map once again. Yeah, I feel like, yeah. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm about to get the end. Oh, my. Are you already there? Uh, oh, oops. It's yeah, fine. You just, just, just make me not reach the end and don't feel accomplished. It's fine. <laughs> 36 minutes wasted. I'm scra I'm scrapping this video. Um, like, uh, don't you usually like, wrap up the video? Or is that it? You're I'm just, always like, waiting for you to like add on. Or... I mean, like, I I agree with you, bro. Like that map was so bad. Oh my god, I hate it.
All right. Well, that is the end of the video. If you all did enjoy, please make sure to like and subscribe. And if you made it all the way to the end, comment the word up. <laughs> comment the word up, but our spirits are down. Comment the word up if you made it all the way to the end for Stumble Up 2. And let me know which one you guys like better, Stumble Up 1 or Stumble Up 2. I'll make a comment down below so you guys can vote. Peace.